My name is Doug Lyman. I'm a film director. I just completed a film called Fair Game about uh, Valerie Plame and Joe Wilson. Wilson never worked for the CIA, but his wife... Is an agency Plame. operative on weapons of mass destruction. He just went ahead and did it. Fair Game, at its essence, is, is about uh, the right of Americans to speak out against their government without the fear of reprisal. Well, the whole Wilson Plame scandal, uh, I think, represents a distortion of the proper relationship between the government and private citizens in a democracy. Uh, when these things are properly in balance, it's the government that should be transparent, uh, and it's citizens' lives that should be private. And, and we've seen that relationship inverted and turned on its head. Joe Wilson. Joe, it's Chris Matthews. I just spoke to Carl Rove. He told me, quote, Wilson's wife is fair game. Joe Wilson, for people who don't know the story, was the whistleblower. He was the first person to tell the world that the Bush administration was lying about the intelligence to go to war in Iraq. Those few men in that building over there are the most powerful men in the history of the world. How much of a stretch do you think it would be for them to take on Joe Wilson? What we saw uh, in the first six years of the Bush administration is that there was absolutely no oversight going on where oversight should take place. We had all branches of government, uh, the Supreme Court, the Congress, and the White House controlled by a single political party. And even as these grotesque abuses were taking place uh, in Abu Ghraib, uh, in Guantanamo, in CIA black sites, um, Congress essentially went to sleep. We're in a place right now where our democracy is dependent on whistleblowers. In the last 10 years, the state secrets doctrine has been invoked so many times by the executive branch that the courts are be basically being kept out of the process. So who's protecting our democracy? What they did was wrong, Val. It was just plain wrong. Don't you ever forget that. It should be much harder for the American people uh, after watching the Wilson Plame episode uh, to trust the government when it makes blanket and categorical statements about the need for secrecy. Because we see how the executive branch manipulates that information. When it's going to be held accountable for its misdeeds, it tries to build a wall around this information. When it wants to target one of its enemies, the very same kind of information, or worse, uh, is cavalierly released to the public. The American people should insist on more transparency in government, but also more oversight of the executive branch, both from Congress and from the courts.